I want to start from the, the beginning. So what is co-working? In my opinion, a mode in which you uh, provide supply workspaces to people. We tend to forget that uh, because it has been an innovative mode, almost viral mode, and uh, everybody talks about co-working nowadays. From the 50s, uh, the last centuries, it's been um, has been developed lots of uh, modality, of this modality, uh, among those uh, business incubator, startup studios, hacker space, shared office or uh, curated offices, uh, flexible offices, uh, co-living, uh, learning spaces and uh, so on. So the industry, the co-working industry, even here in Italy, but globally, I would say, it's um, overlapping some other industry like hospitality industry, community and care or event industry, real estate industry, of course, and among those, the tech industry. I'm going to argue that the focus of uh, co-working, which was uh, at the beginning very much uh, the community is becoming less less important uh, in respect with our technology. Are the co-working less community centered, the more tech centered? Uh, my answer is yes. And uh, in order to make it more visible, this this shift, I try to construct a taxonomy in which you can, uh, in in a way, it could be useful to distinguish different sort of uh, co-working or, or, or flexible offices around the world. If you think you, you have two basic dimensions you, you, you can use, the first one is, are we providing a convenient space or a prestigious location for our customers? On the other side, you have another dimension you can use is, does it impact uh, with the way you work or you used to work before coming in, in my place? So you have a degree. And uh, if you use these two dimensions, you have a quadrant where there is, uh, there has been at the beginning quite empty. So prestigious location, which, which were essentially curated spaces or what we call in Italy business offices. They were running in a traditional way, like a, any other office. Co-working changed everything, proposing a new identity. Now there is a, a, a further step in which technology plays a crucial role in moving all different uh, space offers toward those that, that quadrant, because uh, technology um, gives the opportunity to hybridate spaces and to accommodate very different uh, needs in a proposal to the market uh, by the co-working owners. Having said that, um, we will find some trace of this shifting uh, in, uh, in the data. Um, is, uh, Italian co-working, we, we run since 2017 an annual uh, survey and we collect continuously at, through our website data from uh, co-working um, spaces or uh, business uh, center or shared office in Italy. Co-working movement have, uh, has grown uh, very much uh, in the last uh, few years. Uh, the, the first uh, investigation we found uh, 500 uh, co-working around Italy and, uh, and now we count more than uh, 800 co-working spaces. Around 60% are uh, located in the north and 25% in, uh, in this region Lombardy when uh, uh, this presentation uh, um, is occurring. The first co-working space was uh, made in, uh, in 2008 so quite uh, soon as uh, the model uh, was established and uh, there are quite a few uh, co-working in uh, peripheral areas or in small uh, towns. Uh, they account uh, around uh, 25%. We have a, a, a big divide in the characteristics of the spaces. There are small spaces which account for 60% of this 800 number I gave before. These are mainly under the 300 uh, square meters uh, uh, large on average. While big spaces were really rare uh, some years ago, but uh, investment are more uh, attractive nowadays, even after the pandemic crisis. And uh, they account now uh, for around 15% uh, of, of the spaces, of course, with a, a much larger uh, surface.
So saying that, few international networks are present in, in, in Italy, mainly in, in, uh, in Milan area, and um, two uh, thirds of the co-working owners run other main business. So that's so one out of three co-working uh, co owners really focus on the co-working uh, activity. Co-workers are mainly freelance and professional, though uh, they are declining a little bit. Companies, uh, on the contrary, are growing. Uh, the presence of companies in, uh, uh, in co-working space uh, is accelerating lately uh, after the pandemic. And then we have some remote workers, digital norma uh, nomads, few students, very few students, 4% and uh, almost no uh, civil servants or uh, public uh, company uh, employees. Now, what happened uh, with the pandemic? The pandemic struck really deeply the working, uh, the working movement in Italy. The main revenue streams were uh, stopped for a longer period, like two years. Uh, if you think that events are very important in the economy of co-working, uh, of any co-working owners. You have the picture of what happened uh, uh, in 2020, 2021. Now the situation is, is back as we measured in the uh, last survey, uh, which we run uh, at the, um, uh, basically uh, in December uh, 2021. Uh, the profitability g got back to the level we uh, registered in uh, 2019. But something has changed. Who own other main activities, who, those, those uh, co-working uh, owners try to uh, lower their rent uh, or other expenses uh, by using the, uh, uh, the co-working or by opening a co-working in, in their building um, are much more in trouble, are, are much more uh, uh, vulnerable, less re resilient and so we had lots of uh, this kind of uh, uh, spaces that shut for good. Uh, on the contrary, there has been uh, um, registered a growth in uh, investment in, in bigger spaces which perform much better than, uh, than the small spaces and uh, in technology. Um, people nowadays expect uh, to book on internet their, their desk, uh, to um, go in a co-working space just for a few hours and pay for, for, for a couple of hours, not more. Long term uh, rent is almost uh, rare, so the, the demand is, is rapidly changing. And, and that's where tech is, is, is coming in, in, into play. Uh, there is a need of uh, bigger involvement in uh, technology to manage all this different and dispersed uh, demand for co-working in, in Italy. These are the, 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 the results of the 2000, uh, 2001 uh, survey. It's, uh, it's more tech-centered or community uh, centered uh, nowadays. I would say the first, but it's, uh, it's open to the floor and uh, open to who wants to analyze the data, which is, uh, will be provided uh, open for anybody who wants to have a look.